This is the lecture for Mary Midgley's article, Trying Out One's New Sword. And it's a very short one because there's not much you need to know before you read the article. The only thing I'm going to mention is uh, that this introduces us to another large topic in philosophy, uh, ethics, also called morality. Uh, in philosophy, these are synonyms. So ethics, the study of ethics, the study of morality, they're just the same thing. And this is about what is right and wrong, good and bad, morally right and wrong, morally good and bad, what kind of person you ought to be, what sort of things you ought to do, what kind of society we should have, um, these sorts of things. So this is an interesting topic because it's one of the ones that people think is sort of most centrally belongs to philosophy. So there have been lots of people arguing that various fields of philosophy will eventually be replaced by other disciplines. If you look at sort of the historical development of lots of disciplines, they developed out of philosophy. So if you go way back in history, who was doing all of the intellectual inquiry? Well, like people we would call philosophers today. But then eventually we started getting tools for figuring things out that sort of went beyond or no longer counted as philosophy. So uh, they started to split off into various sciences. So we now have physics and chemistry and so on for trying to explain gravity and how the world works. And we have biology for explaining where animals come from. It used to be philosophers trying to explain these things, but now, no, I like my job is not to tell you how physics works or where animals come from. But uh, ethics slash morality, uh, this is one of the things that a lot of people think this will never be taken away from philosophy. This is sort of one of the central topics, uh, which is always going to be the domain of philosophy. So that's maybe interesting. Um, but this article is about a specific topic in ethics, sort of judging other cultures, and in fact, judging the ethics of other cultures in various ways and imposing ethics on other cultures. So uh, that's what we're studying here. And uh, I'm, this, this is probably obvious, but this is a good article to think about in terms of what do you think? So Midgley is giving you an argument and you can decide to what extent do I agree or disagree and why. Uh, this is, I think, a straightforward enough article that you can have opinions yourself uh, sort of directly when you're reading it. So do that.